Okay, okay everyone, uh, I think we should uh, get going. It's okay. time. Okay, so the next patient is Jenny. Jenny is a 27 year old. Um, she's recently been diagnosed with cervical cancer following an abnormal smear. She doesn't have children but would love to start a family. So she has an early stage tumour. It's 9 millimetres wide and 5.3 millimetres deep. But the margins are involved. What does the imaging show? So the PET scan shows one lymph node, but it's likely to be benign. Well, she could be a candidate for a radical trachelectomy, and if we're successful, hopefully she could carry a baby to term. That's possible, but there may not be enough healthy tissue for that. Alex, is chemoradiotherapy an option? It is an option. I'd only advise chemoradiation if the tumour has spread outside the cervix, and chemoradiation would make her infertile. I've spent some time with Jenny and her partner in clinic and having a baby means everything to her. I mean the surgery certainly would increase the risk of complications in pregnancy but if she's fully informed I'm very happy to support this. Yeah, yes I agree with you John. The other thing is that she's a candidate for the FRIENDS study. This is the trial where we reduce the number of lymph glands that we remove. So in summary we're saying radical trachelectomy to preserve fertility and enrolment into the FRIENDS research study. Are we all agreed? Yes. yes. That's great. Okay, so we'll bring back the case to the MDT after the surgery. <laughs>